thought that squirrels would eat mushrooms. Squirrel eating mushrooms. <laughs> Guess that means those things are safe to eat. <laughs> Let's go have a bite. <laughs> if we find a dead squirrel in the morning, we'll never. Mm -hmm. Must be pretty tasty. You know, I or thought he must I, be very hungry. Yeah, I thought I saw a chunk out of that mushroom this morning that looked a little weird, like it, like an animal got to it or something. Well, somebody's been squirrel. eating my beans, my string beans in the backyard, oh. so I went ahead and picked one, even though it was about only that big. Right, but otherwise it was going to disappear. Minis. Yeah, let them eat these fungus. <laughs> Because I've seen that before where some big old toadstools come up and they disappear. And she's like, where did those go? <laughs> did they just die and shrivel up? No, oh, the squirrels eat them. He loves it. It's really munching down. Well, they probably die if they eat it. If they right. eat something that's bad for them, so it probably like gets ingrained to them. So we need to they know to avoid each it. other. And I've heard tells them, look, don't eat these, but those other ones are okay. I've heard <laughs> things that uh, that fears can be passed down through genes. Like for example, people having like fears of bugs or spiders or snakes, some things like that. They say that, that. it can be almost ingrained in us. You know that we just kind of instinctually know to stay away from it or something.